Mapongini Kemi Medicine Sana Sering Bible Baptist Radio. Ye Hato Ripan Sonat Si Borobarola Falafan, Seri Pester, J. Berlin McGee. What more can he say than to you he hath said? To you who for refuge to Jesus have fled. What do you do with your fears? Met kipotogani ferry, renom kana ni wakus. Job, in the 41st chapter, the 33rd verse, has this statement, Who is made without fear? That's a relative clause there, but we can turn it very nicely into an interrogative clause and ask the question, Who is made without fears? Lan pugen yob, sapun feik meil, wokisin, edik melgat, ena wen yob a kabasi yosun. Yowe is a poor and nuokus. Melon and avocasin, and yob karakabas, rafis poyots kabasin poerete. Ne was your son, she often tongue and issue with your nyots kabasis. Yowe is a poor and nuokus. Fears are feelings that we all share to varying and different degrees and kinds of fears. So could nuokus. In I go so could me mef, oh, kids medicine, she are me feel on it, but me fair a cot. A cot give me fear no cuss, ratong any wet day, he got but a coon, when a cot so could me fear no cuss. Even me even a ramas, I want to any no cussity, so could I ten so could me tot. We sometimes smile at the old bromide that women are always afraid of a mouse. But the bravest man today would be mortally afraid if he knew he was going to have a baby. Fere kot, mwen rakan takiri, ewe purau susun fefin. Pue fefin medicine, rakan niweiti nakkit. Nge, ewe mwen agon ete pura. Agon pura cho, seri mwen medicine, me wan urusen furufan. Ewe fen chok mojin melo rena niwakus. Are poya rong porosan pue hi wisin e pude no na di heaven mercon Psychology lists fear along with love and anger as one of the strong and complex emotions of the human species E ke wa tok ter me si de yu sun e ki e ki na ramas ra kana ba sa pue e ke wa so kun me fien ni wakus Rakarusun me fien tong me me fien song nan ne di ben emen aramas ike ike wasokun me mef amen fokun wei re saat si pue wo wei ti usur a kantori marawe na ramas medicine me wan for the fun it's doubtful whether this morning any member of the human family anywhere is devoid of fear if he is he's an abnormal individual Lani soran sa fo kun ti be mora mora resini are bo me yor even aramas wan urusian farifan min ne se new york city i ka new york di yo smet tots ngai are bo me yor even aramas wan farifan min ne se ap new york di i ka new york city yo smet tots me yor wo so su go su kan it's part of our human makeup as any other factor that we share it's just as common as eyes and nose and mouth. Hey, me thoughts new akus. Fokuni ye yot soku sokun. Yot nikiri ki non marawen even aramas. New akus ira yot kifetin non marawat. Usurutuk mesat. Ika seringat. Ika awat. Fear was the first outward. Evidence and manifestation of the effect of the disobedience of Adam in the Garden of Eden. It was the first symptom of sin. Niwokus irawe akowan harukurukun harin netayan we Adam a anaya sorat ngi nikot melanawe tanipin Eden. Niwokus irawe akowan harin netayan me esisinen tipis. For the very first thing that Adam did, and he confessed it, 
He says, I heard thy voice in the garden, and I was afraid because I was naked. Pun e wea ko wan me to cha da ma ba sha a pa re te ngi ni ko te pe wa rong me ri om me lo ni ta ni bi ngi yo wa ni o kus pun wa se re ro This man the first thing that he confessed was that he was afraid We se we sha ni yei e wea ko wan me to e mo ya pa re te ngi ni ko pe i a ni o kus From that day, fear entered into the very web and woof of mankind, and man went out of the Garden of Eden, told that by the sweat of his brow he would earn his bread, and driven by hunger and thirst and fear, man penetrated over this earth. Sheria na fan shon feno, ei ve tots ni wakus a te fotu fotu long a to long. ナンネウテンメレティペンアラマスメディシンエウエアラマスアトウシェニラノウエタンピリテンネコタウレニイポエエポヤガンフェリテナネポオラナンモガフィティモロルンエテンメシャンイウエレネケユルガテメトチラウ
My beloved, he's very frank to say he was a man of fear, and yet here's a man that's known for his bravery. David Eseubolo, Afin Kabas Winichar, Le Kabas Susuneke Wafanson, Nubuni Yamefi Nyokus, non Nediban. Gifin David Yewen, half a Kunite Fulo, Pogitan Tivabora. Elijah was a brave man. Elijah stood before the prophets of Baal, and he stood before Ahab. It was so false, Elijah, Ika, Elias, even so false, Amen Fokun Porato. I don't know what happened to him, but I do know this, there was a great breakdown in his life when there came word from Jezebel that she would seek his life, and this man turned and ran, and he beat it for Beersheba, and he wouldn't stop there. He went as far in the desert as he could and climbed underneath a juniper tree. Usei sile hi kameta wese wese fish ngani Elijah lon marawan nge wa sire sire lon kabesen kot pue lu pueni arong purashan pue kiwin chesebel e pue tinalo nen ke wese on fiu pue repeniero e wa mwe ani laicha lon ana otun ne ti peni laicha ha mer fokun ni okus nge i a suro sire wa kiwin Ah, with your cello, read a well any, fair sheba, yea, such a coat on me again. Ah, one cello, lot of a fur upper. Ah, took for concert, Torian is a tune tongue and is yet. He went up with him to redo, fair efforts, he ran to never. He doesn't say he's afraid, but his actions speak louder than any words that he could give us. Elijah is a wishing poor rete, read on capas, ne, apasapwe, e ave nuocus. May I say to you that you'll find that the bravest of men have been those that have been afraid. May I say to you this morning, all of us have something today that fills our hearts with fear. And fear down in the history of the race has been looked upon as a weakness of man. It's been looked upon as a detriment. Men have always been applauded for their bravery. They've been ridiculed for their fears. Haramas rakan nengani ewe tots nyokus usin nge ye eot sokuna pwang apwang awor non marawena ramas. Ye eot sokun ni pwaya kingaw main nom non marawena ramas ewe tots nyokus. Haramas rakan episi eke wemwen mei tiba pura me puratso nge rata kiri me turunu fasei eke wemei nyokus. Only cowards fear is an accepted cliche even today and we're ashamed of our fears. Ye ots muidun ots kabas melon feruate ye kane pue fokun te ke kana harama simi mosaguta ra kan nyokus. Iwe kit si a fokun si a wesiri e ke we me fi nyokus ha tori kit non neti bats. And the most popular books since World War II have been books that have dealt with the subject of fear, dealing with this general theme of freedom from fear. Iwe ekewe sokun puk mei maketiu seni fansion ewe maun mirap ewe World War II toto tori ikenai ekewe sokun puk karamas mirisin rakan sekmutsin meri me anneari ikena kewe puk akan makusun ei metots niwakus me ebo feni fasakun Ad si botongani ngasero seriat kewe niwakus. 
My beloved, the Bible has never gone along with this worldly philosophy and this popular fallacy of the day. The Bible just doesn't take that position at all. I believe that in the Word of God that fear can be divided into two major classifications. The first fear is fear of God, and that's good. Then there is the fear of man. It was said of Cromwell that he was the bravest man who ever lived. Someone asked Cromwell one day what was the secret of his bravery and why he was considered such a brave man. Aramas Rakarabasa, who soon away when he is on England, he then Cromwell, he a mala lanke with you to Buguia Ralo. Aramas Rakarabasa, who soon in a man where Fokuni, he went when may tipura, la pesini Aramas made seen may fin mana one for the fun. Nani Ren, even Aramas Akapasi, Sneni and I went Cromwell. He ka, he found one of one and I went tipura. Pata Aramas Rakan, a kiaki soon e pue, Fokuni away. And he said this, I've learned from the Word of God that if you fear God, you will not have any man to fear. He went and I went from well, I put a winning any at dinner. Ye met Nang Wakayo, Seni Cabasin Court. Poy are even a ramas, if when you could see the goat, he went a sub two and war even a ramas, mean ye, if when you ate. And may I say to you, that's the secret David had learned. Here in this 56th Psalm, the 11th verse, he says, In God have I put my trust. I will not be afraid what man can do unto me. And then you will find that that's so important that when you move over to the 13th chapter of the epistle to the Hebrews, the 6th verse, so that we may boldly say, The Lord is my helper, and I will not fear what man shall do unto me. He went, she are good up where we see we see ye, ill kite me for Kunotia. Pun up one market you learn, he went to stamit me for Lon Pukeni Prus up when one made the gut walk sin on you. He apasa, ye be net, she are togany, tipe porazzo, me a pidu curts, ne apasa. He was some old e, I told an in this. Nang usa fokun nuokus, me at Aramas, repotong any furring any ye. My beloved, this morning, you will either have today a fear of God, or you have a fear of man. Either this morning you are afraid of those things that are about you and what men say and what men do, or this morning you are afraid of God. And somebody says, well, I don't think we ought to be afraid of God. 
I say to you today, friends, we do well to fear God. And if we fear him, we'll not have any man to fear. I would like this morning to identify some common fears, and I want to limit ourselves because of the time to two fears that are common today. That if we fear God, we will be delivered from these fears. The first is the fear of loneliness, the fear of being alone. My friend today, only God can deliver you from the fear of loneliness. A pastor today who does any counseling at all has many cases where he'll ask this question, especially is it true of some very fine woman, Christian woman generally. And the question is this, why did you marry this man who is so inferior to you? It's on such a much lower level than you are. And I've heard them say it again and again. Well, you know, I was getting up in years, and I was afraid I might have to go through life alone. Ngang wa fen rong rong he kei fe fin fen chom mong ra kan pelu wen ye ka si nei ngang wa ni okus pun wa pan to ri ye rin fe fin nge u se wo pu pu lu u fen ni okus pe ne man u pu le chek ha ke de me ro chek nan ma la we i na pa ta hu a pu lu wen ni amen and i want to say to you this morning most of them wish they had gone through life alone because that's something they should not fear at all. The Bunko Squad will tell you today in, of the police department that the confidence men prey on unsuspecting folk, both men and women, who are alone, lonely. 
even confidence man, ika even con man, ira i even aramas, e pue apuru husunge i tienom, e pue tia tia tngonuk me, motien arap ngonuk lan manaum, ge wese wesan, i even aramas, me kavas to forangonuk, a motien tia tingonuk, pue potongani sore ani seluk, o moni, e keo police, me ton investigators, Reputsak tonga ni pwe reta inge ni kebi pwe He kei sokun wen, he kei con artist Ratsak soun, tia ti inge ni me hokotubu Mwen me fefin, he seni finifin He kewe sokun aramas mei, akere amentu klan manawer Rapos, pun eseor, tia ne rika aramas er mei Arab inge nir nan manawer Ina po pun amet seres inge nir, ar reputubu te Rene kei sokun kan men in case you can aramas me tuk otubun furry pwe ir tia tia om nge wese wesan ratuk mo tia sore ani seluk moni there are many young people today who are afraid to take a stand for Christ because they've reached that age where they have the herd instinct and they say what would the gang say amen fokun tommong ad menengin aruan me furpun hikenei Raniwokus arrepwe ute feniten krais. Un ratori ewe fansou non manawer lupwen tia tiaer amen fokun au tia ngenir. Ramen fokun osipwangan ane poor tia ner. Ramen osipwangan me motien pwe tia ner kewe repwe sani ir me tia tia ngenir. E kei se refe rakane kia ki me tia tia kewe repwe fena pasa arrepwe upwe furri ena sokun. I'd lose my friends. I have the feel of the pack, and I want to be a fam. And if I took a stand for Christ, I'd lose my friends, and I'd be alone. Tia nei kewe repopeu tia ido, resap tuen mo tien tia tinga ni ei. Ngang hua fokun me filan nei ti pei, ai ei hua mo tien mu tia ti fengen me tia nei kei. Ngai arai ka ngang upo ute fani ten Christ non manawei. There are multitudes of older men and women today who would take a stand for Jesus Christ today and they're saying, what would my friends say? What would the crowd say that I run with? What would my business associates think? Afin fan chomong, mwen me fefin higenei. Ra yi sirei non neti per pwe Merits are repueta pula mirin Christ. Merits are repueta fani ten Christ. Nera fian pusin kavasi singenir. Meta tiere kewe reputhena pasausi. Meta tiere kewe ton pisnis reputhene kia kiusi. A repuyu poi rausun. What would my social cronies think of me if I took a stand for Christ? Meta tiere kara one soap melon town reputhene kia kiusi. I say it to you this morning carefully, but I say it nonetheless. Multitudes are going today into a lost eternity because they're afraid of men. And they ought to be afraid of God. What do you think about the people who are living in the world? I think it's a big deal. Rafete ngeniar repumelo lan fiyanga isemuts. Rafete ngeniar repumelo lan we hill. Pogiten ra nuok city aramas. Ngeme fen murin ngenir ar repufen nuok city court. May I say to you there's no reason to be afraid of loneliness. Enle tu pokavas ngeni kemi pwe isewor ot popun om kobonuedi he metot ekere merirot kwonom. God's men have always been lonely men. Seni te kanso nom nom, neun kot kewe aramas, fien panir, aramas mi he kere merirotek. They've lived alone and liked it. Ir ra he kere mentek nan manawer, ni ra tu ene te kiramwe. Noah was not invited out to all the social functions of his day. Noah stood alone for God. Noah is a yuka ngeni ane pwifiti a kewe turap me a kewe pari medicine minera kan fifis nan furuan. 
Abraham was probably the most popular man in Ur of the Chaldees. They had a high civilization. Archaeology tells us today that life in Ur of the Chaldees was pleasant in Abraham's day. He had many friends and he was successful in business and one day God called him and my friends it meant loneliness for that man during the rest of his life. He went on in some monk, see it in a prayer, Lord and I lay any. He have one for kun so puts, Lord and give a young in business, he are can any long er. He will on a rent, go to a curry a prayer, where a put those any for the one. A put up all on with rain coat. Near me see it here canna, any prayer, a hood a fenit and coat, a top all on with rain coat. He are where when prayer, not a cure loose in year in Marawan medicine. He may took. Daniel was in a foreign court and that was bad enough. But this man took a stand for God and probably no man has ever lived a more lonely life than Daniel. Daniel a oro nani uferu en tonekis hi a hangang lani mwenewe king kigerekis Saul of Tarsus was the most popular Pharisee in Jerusalem, and Saul of Tarsus one day met Jesus Christ. And that man walked alone during the rest of his life. He was when Saul sent it as this, he was a Pharisee, half a kunite fellow, mele in a kewe Pharisee medicine. Nelani ran, Saul sent it as this, I at the one, Jesus Christ, none but one. On we read in a function, he half a kunzuk, a remed rotuk, lane kewe lucidin, red in Marawan medicine. My friend today, the man or the woman that will take a stand for Jesus Christ and will face the fear of man, he says, I will be with thee. I will never leave thee nor forsake thee. <laughs> The Lord Jesus said to his own when he was leaving them, and they were to face difficult days, he said this, I will not leave you orphans, I'll come to you. It was some of Jesus, our Rani Pussy known Kewet on Kyle, Lupona for Kunarabakan Fanson, and a Pulefe no Serir, Ne ear Rebuleto long non Fanson Riafo, Lon Manawer. Jesus, our Renir, Nang Usab Nikiti Kebiro, Mason, Nang Ubudefokun Feto Remi. Then he said to them before he left, Lo, I'm with you always, even to the end of the age. He went Caesar's up one of the near, Memwen and half it that end. Nangani, Nang who put on nom remi, Torines of Bolon, a kiddy kiddy fun My friend today, 
to be afraid of man and to deny yourself the fellowship of God who will never forsake you and never leave you lonely. Om kobotong ani tia ji fengen ren kot fokun iewe esa fokun su seluk iewe esa nikitukuro narom ka ere mensuk Paul at the last could write all men have forsaken me but he could write this the lord stood by me Lupan Paul ato rifan shon ha ne pode mutsuro ato ngani maketiu Aramas medicine rasu senie rani kiti edo nge pola pantonga ni maketiu nge ewa samol a ute huruki a fokure te knan nom re multitudes down through the ages have overcome this awful thing this thing that's known as fear of loneliness by taking a stand for Jesus Christ Afian tsomong te pete bene kewe aramas seni fansion nom nom tori kenai ratonga ni poratso ngeni hei sokun nyokus nan manawer hei sokun nyokus sa nyokus iti at sa remensek rao kufu hei sokun nyokus nan manawer pokiten ra ute wenachar peniten Jesus Christ then the last that i'd like to mention to you is fear of death and judgment iwe ewe amutiron sokun nyokus wa muten kapas ngeni ki tusun hey nyokus iti mero me ewe fanson kabung ewe feito my friend today death and judgment are an awful reality en tieti e higenai mero me ewe fanson kabung Fokuni kena kewe ru met tots mi wese wesan hor e po wese wesen fis and you may have your brain washed today by modern thinking but you never get rid of death and judgment and you can't dismiss it with a wave of the hand me tu vit pue iganai ka fen tu pute ren sokopaten ke din farifan Kapen fiti e kia kin farifan nan marawom. Nge kisap tonga ni su seni e kei ru met tots. Mero me ewe fansion kapun. Kese tonga ni pomo ngeni e kei ru met tots po repwe su senuk. Kese tonga ni e marungaw seni e kei ru met tots repwe ne fokun fis. Mero me ewe fansion kapun. We do well today to fear death and judgment. E po fena ats ngani kit. Si po fena mirit. Are we si bo ni wakusiti mero me ewe fanson kapun he bo feito The scripture says he that being often reproved and hardeneth his neck shall suddenly be destroyed and that without remedy He wa kabesin ko ta basa emen mi yange ha pun fanson mong nge ya tek uluferia he bo mutir rosoro nge sa por met he bo tongani cigarren Paul went in before Felix the governor not to defend himself but to present to him the claims of Christ and it said he reasoned with Felix concerning righteousness the righteousness of Christ Paul au when mission Felix he a governor he said to them when mission we 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 read that we see on case and he a governor nge ya au them when mission and when we 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 read that any e Usun ewa kabasa liven Jesus Christ. Ena wogsin a basa pwe Paul. A sa pwe ro ne hawe we ngani Felix. Usun pung. Fokun en Christ ewe pung. Self-control. How Christ could control that man. Tibe pos. Me tibe fesir. Le nemeni motirin pusin irisit. Usun en Christ ewa tongani nemerem. Lan marawen emen aramas. And then the third thing, judgment to come. If he turned his back on Jesus Christ, he was going before a holy God, and it would be a frightful eternity ahead of him. He went out again, 
Paula kabas ngeni Felix usun e we fansun kabung e po warredo. Arre po Felix e po yakunus a kurun ngeni Jesus Christ. Arre yasap e tiwa Christ nan malawan i we e kiselo tuk i e po leu wen mesen e men kot me yurusen pin. I we ria fung e siam wut a men fokun e ni wokus me amasuk a tuk se so di ate nan e we hel. And it says that Felix feared and trembled and dismissed Paul because he didn't want to hear any more about it at all, my beloved. E kana wakasin ra basapwe Felix a niwakus o tetsits nge murin a kabas ngeni Paul pwe e pwe feino e pwe wes ne kabas ngeni i Felix e se tu en moti rongorong husun e kewe tots. The scripture says the fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom so reverential fear e wa kavesin kot a vesa pwe nuokus kot ira le poputen ti vetse medisin e so kun nuokus ye ye nuokus mi fiti venin mi fiti sufen it's a fear of god that does not come from that which is base or craven but it's a fear of god that comes through reverence knowing that our god is a high and holy god and that he must punish sin ye ye was so kun yo kusi ti kot esa pop seni fituk esa pop seni netip mi mosaguta nge feni ye e was so kun yo kus kot a pop seni netip eleven mei fo kun meni niti me su fari ti kot no netipan mi sirei pue kot me yuru sen tekia me yuru sen pin Esa tonga ni tipe nga ni tipis. E pwede tsek fokuna pungu tipis. Lan mana wena ramas. Even a beatitude is given to those that fear the Lord. In Psalm 112, one, it opens with this language. Blessed is the man that feareth the Lord. Lan ewe paipen, me ipon ma ketiw ewe aden feyot. Nga ni eke wea ramas, me inu e kusi ti kot. Lan kon fen sapun. He put away one meru, walk sin ill, and I walk sin a pesa. A feyot, a way a ramas, me in your city, a way some old me la bala. And then I discovered this week a verse I don't think I'd ever noticed before. In Proverbs, the 28th chapter, the 14th verse Happy is the man that feareth always, but he that hardeneth his heart. Shall fall in the mischief. I will on it a quick, one nearly hill walk sin non cabasin coat, mine use a conian a key accused soon, mem one. Yelani week, Luponua, and nearly a walk sin, good me fair half a kun cabas in a day to be. And I walk sin me macatil lun, and Solomon Foss, Sapun Rue Mewanu, walk sin a gone meruenu. Pop one, heaven a ramas, me new oak city, I was Samuel Mirapalap, Fanson medicine. Nghe yattewe mi ulu feria le lukan e bwe turulong lon tibis. This morning, God has put fear in your heart. That fear, my beloved, today can be your salvation or it can be your undoing. Nghe sorry, kot awa long lan le lukom e yve toj ni wakus. E na ni wakus a tonga ni fish bwe me te bwe popu Om kobo fe toren Christ o kuna mara wisemut renom hetiwa i nge ena ni wakus a pontonga ni popu om kobo uluferia na nerukom o tururong na tibis me fe nga fotse fots. Fear is not something that's always base or craven. If it's today a fear of God, it's good. Ni wakus isa pina wot smetot mijak pop seni fituk fanson medicine. Isa pwila awat si metot, mi fiti me fiyan masaguta, panson medisin. Ni wakus kot, ina awat si metot, me murina. If you are fearing men today and what they think, it's a terrible thing. Nge are po ye ni kanay ka, ni wakus iti aramas, me me taramas rato nga ni abasa, ni wakus awat si metot, me wasi wasi ngal. I remember a friend of mine, I was in school with him, was a pastor in the East Texas oil fields at the time of the explosion at the New London School. 
lupuen ngangu afiti Bible College. Tiene iwe i even pester, me lana we fanu Texas. Me noma rafa kanyani ya kewaleni, oil fields. Ya rafer kewa tsaritu, fani ten, oyen. Nani na leni me yorrewe, shigun. Eu elementary school et tangeni high school. Itele na shigul, New London School. Lanawe yer ngarau tiwa puku ilik me fisu, me yorot gas leak lane na shigun. Me yorrewe gas line me fane na iwe shigun, iwe ewe gas alit. Nge ekewe aramase nane na shigun rese tuk sire usun. Iwe lanawe ren ma shigun me wanu ngarau tiwa puku ilik me fisu, En a kes, me lit me fene na imwen sigun a pung. Iwe unusen ewe sigun a fokun rosero. I never shall forget that night that word came in on the radio that that school had exploded and that over 300 boys and girls had been killed. Ngang usa fokun tongeni menukolo en a pwilin. Lupunua eseling eni ewe ritio, ngewa rong porosan pwe ena kies me lits me fene we yimwen sigun a pung, nge urusien ewe yimwen sigun a fokun rosoro. Lupuna pisena explosion, me yor napeseni urupuku semirit et menengin ramero. I was speaking the next morning on the radio revival in Dallas, Texas. And that morning I directed everything I had to say to the parents and loved ones of those boys and girls. We had cards and letters from New England, from Cuba, from Mexico, from all over the country. Lana we ran, we ran, a fish in a accident. Ngang upwe a falafan wan ritio. Me lana we teri ni mwen talis. Iwe lana na soran nupwenua a falafan wana we ritio. Me tots meirisin minne hua apasa, hua kantsu kapas ngeni ekewe, inelap me sebelap, arramasin ekewe, et menengin, ramero. Me yor arramas ra makkei tarubwe, ngeni emena radio station, ra kan makkei non tarubwe, ar kapongen tubung mire tipetta, ngeni arramasin ekewe semirit mi vero. Ai ajatiwa tarubwe seni, tommong sokopaten leni, seni New England, Mexico, Cuba, Sokopaten states me wan urusen faru merka ratuk makke tarupwe kapwonge ne tipeta ren ewe accident afis. But this pastor friend of mine told me this story. He said in the parish in which I was the pastor, there lived a man that had become suddenly rich. He was a Texan who had become oil rich. He went TNA Iwe, Tona Falafan, E. Evan Fester, and when we defend main on nom not a soap, ya a fish and a accident here, a way in West Sugul, a pung, a Russian Rosoro. Waka Timeni, a way for Rouse, TNA Iwe, a Aporosang any a. E. A Cabasing any a way. May you remember when, men on a soap, ya, I went with a fair and omia. E. Evan when. A mutir tuk ne fisegi sekiro me wo pokiten ekewe tuan kutta oyen ra kunakun oyen me fean furuan. Iwe ena wen a fokun wo a fokun fisegi sekiro pokiten ewe oyen ra kunakun melon furuan. And he had made already several millions of dollars. He built a lovely home. He had a wife and two lovely boys. And the wife and the two boys were both, all of them, Christians, members of his church. And I went, I found out that I was going to be the audience. And I went, I was going to be the one who was going to be the one who was going to be the one who was going to be the one. I went to the one, I went to the one who was going to be the one who was going to be the one who was going to be the one. I went to the one, I went to the one who was going to be the one who was going to be Jesus Christ. Iwe ewe inerap menun kewe rue menet Rafi ti fen Nare we mwiti fen Ia tiere iwe hakan Afarafan meye And he said this man was the worst blasphemer He'd ever met in his life He said I've never heard a man talk As that man would talk He'd blaspheme God Curse God Tiere iwe ton afarafan akapas pwe Ewe semenap 
Ena mwen mei muttir pise gise kino ren ewa oin. I men mwen mei fokun silk o te ki kot. I a fokun kapasing au le o te ki kot. Ennet use mor rong rong emen. E pwe usu den a mwen le kapasien o te ki kot. A fokun feu ni mweri i ten kot. And he said his wife was so concerned about him and asked me to go see him. He said I went to see him. He said, I've never been treated like that in my life. He cursed me from the time I opened my mouth until I got out of earshot. He was on a farafan a renie. Puluan in a man a fokun no dilerie siri puluan. A ting or ngerie, po yu bwe fein no turi i. He was on a farafan a kapaspe. Lupunu wa fein no turi in a man. Ennet usye mo rong rong he men wen he po yu su den a man ne kapas. I a tuk fokun o te ki ei, se ri fan seon hua ha kouen kapoan ngeni, to ri fan seon hua fei no se ri, hu se tuen tongani rong rong mea ta ae ni kapas. He called me everything that was in the book, and he said some things I didn't know were in the book. He was vile. Ha ku ri ngeni ei, so ko pahatin so kun kapasi ngau. Po are kot so ku kapasi ngau, u se mo bin rong rong. I e ben mwen me yuri se ni ben ngau. His wife and one of the little boys took sick during the flu epidemic and both died at the same time. Puluen ewe mwere we me eben nur kewe et rasem wen nupona fi seu sawatir me lan furu ewe iwe ewe fe fin me eben nur we et rame lo me rumen nor we eu tuk fansion. He said I went over that night to see them. And he said, I went in and there sat the father and the little boy that was alive. And he said, I went over and sat down by the side of him began to talk, and he said he began to abuse me again, and curse, he said, I've never heard anything like it. Ua fino, mommot, urukun, ewe mwen, ua popute le kapas ngeni i. Nge, ena mwen, a hapan tuk popute se fe ne kapas i ngal ngeri ei. Use mo rong rong hot kapas susun, e kewe kapas ena mwen, a hapasa, a fokun wese wese en kapas i ngal me otek. It was vile, beyond description. He blasphemed God's name. He said there was nothing left for me to do but to get up and walk out of there, which I did. He said, I had the funeral. He wouldn't even speak to me. And he said he became more vile after that. But he said all of the love that he'd had for his family, and that seemed to be the only thing about the man that was a redeeming feature, was now turned to this one little boy that was left. That little boy was in the New London school. New London School. He said that this man, when he heard of it, went out to that school and went through that rubble like a madman. 
Tiene y hueso a la fan, a urani y hue. Lupuene a men, en a shivelap, a rong por rosan, y hueso shigun, pues a pun, y hueso kesh. En a men, a mutir fein o geni, y hueso ya, en a lady en shigul en omia. A tuk fokun, a toto le kuta, no rue, fene kewe pibi me, shivin me, pulak me fokunachuk parash fein. A tuk kukuta, no rue et, usunge, feni yemen wen, merumwish. Until he found the torn, twisted, broken body of that little boy, then took it in his arms and walked up and down that schoolyard like a madman until they actually took it away from him and took it to the funeral home. <laughs> ナシベラパアゲイイリシンヌルウェランペンケウェアチョクエキヌルウェヘトメイメロゲヤフェテンフェインルクヌラレリエンシュゴルウシュルチョクゲイヘベララマシメルムエシャフォクニキトロヌル
A young pastor the last time I saw him told me that that oil man was still serving God. Friend today, you do well to fear God. But if you trust him, you've committed your life to him, you've taken him as Savior, then you can say with David, The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. Yea, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for thou art with me. En siere hi kene, he pole fere tsunguk, om ko boni wa kusi ti kot. Nge are ke bo anamu om nukuruk wan kot, are ke bo fangolo mana wom ngeni i. Are ke bo ti wa Christ, bo i om tsona mana. He went ke bo tonga ni fiti te fit ne abasa, e wa samul mi la pala, i e tsun mas. Usa po supuang reno tsmetot. Hiramo are u pe feten non ne morun tsukun nurun mero. Usa pni wei ti o tsmetot menga. Purien kara nom rei. And it's only then that the scripture's true that says, Perfect love casteth out all fear. Nye fokuni da tuk ewe fan shon. Lupuen e wakishin a tonga ni let. Nan Marawum, Ewa Wakisin A Pesapwe, Tong Mir Research, A Osuro, Sokun Nuakus, Medicine. Shall we bow our heads in prayer? Sata Petty, Pesipoyotic. Jesus, may be born. Killy children on Pity Kids, near sitting a Falafan Seni, Dr. J. Vernon McKee. A Ripuyen, Kamutin, it was Jesus, non Nitipo. O kuna manawe se muits, iwe kopuyani ei so kuniotek. Maing si ses, uasi lei, puengang eben son tipis. Neiwa luku, puyen, ka fien mero fianitei. O manawe se fien. Kosi muitzin, kopu tolong non manawe. O musora e tipis medicine. Oli fang eni ei, ewe manawe se muits. Ua muitzin eti wak, puyen ko paya isa muit. Nani tom si ses, ua yotek, amen. Arrebu mei orong kapasis, ka tunga ni kakurikit nam panas phone 330-3453. Iwe pan pito piti kids na atipen harong nantaku Bible Baptist Church. Thank you for listening to this sermon by Dr. J. Vernon McGee. If you would like to pray and invite Jesus to come into your heart, then pray this prayer after me. Dear Jesus, I know that I am a sinner. I believe that you died for me on the cross and that you came alive again. Please come into my heart, forgive my sins, and give me your free gift of eternal life. I want to receive you as my Lord and Savior. In Jesus' name, Amen. If you have any questions, our number is 330-3453. And come visit us at our church in Nantaku, Bible Baptist Church. Obupan fiti kids non eke fan son mats. Lubwen sibule rong rong, wanewa falafan, serien kot kapas.